the public sector is navigating crisis to crisis to crisis. Demand is skyrocketing. It's incredibly complex. Finances in the public sector, they are beyond stretched. What's not working in the public sector is you've got the same professionals and practitioners working around the same people. That isn't delivering the best user experience to individuals who are often the most vulnerable, often in their times of most need. I don't necessarily think there's a simple solution. I think that's actually really, really tough. People, place and care is our way of navigating some of the pressures faced across the public sector right now. It's about bringing together housing, local government, social care, the criminal justice system and healthcare to really come together and to think around what is it in their local community from a place-based approach that they really need and how can they best deliver those services to the people in their time of need. There is an opportunity to better align professionals around the people who are receiving services to reduce the fragmentation of service delivery and to think about how services can be provided on a place-based footprint around local communities and local need. Thinking about a people, place and care approach, the best way to navigate some of these challenges and pressures within the public sector is to think about the needs of a place, the people within that place, the demand within that place and the needs of the people um, within that particular community. And to think about how we can empower leaders, multidisciplinary teams to really come together and provide integrated service delivery from an operational perspective. There is a, an opportunity to really think around future-proofing local organisations around the service provision from an operational delivery context, how they embrace that change, giving them the digital skills, the tools to be able to really deliver effective public sector services and to deliver better outcomes for people in their time of need.